In this video we'll briefly discuss what is methanamic acid, and how it works, what it's used for, the dose and side effects, and contraindications and precautions. Methanamic acid is a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medication. It decreases inflammation, pain and fever, through inhibition of cyclooxygenase activity and prostaglandin synthesis. It is available as 250 and 500 mg tablets, and it is also available as an oral suspension. Methanamic acid is used as analgesic for moderate pain and in the treatment of primary dysmenorrhea. And the usual initial dose of methanamic acid for adults and children older than 14 years is 500 mg followed by 250 mg every 6 hours as needed. Usually, it is not used longer than one week. Methanamic acid may cause allergic reactions, epigastric pain, peptic ulcer, hemorrhage, and renal impairment. It is contraindicated in case of hypersensitivity to methanamic acid or cross-sensitivity with other non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medications and aspirin. It is also contraindicated in case of active gastric ulcer or chronic inflammation of gastrointestinal tract and in case of renal disease. Methanamic acid should be administered with meals followed by full glass of water or milk to avoid gastrointestinal and esophageal irritation. And it may be given with antacids if stomach upset occurs. Do not use it for more than one week, and if given for dysmenorrhea, begin taking medication with onset of bleeding and associated symptoms. Discontinue medication if rash develops and contact your physician. And also report these symptoms to your physician. Rash, visual problems, dark stools, decreased urinary output, persistent headache or stomach pain, and unusual bruising or bleeding. Avoid intake of alcoholic beverages, and also avoid taking any OTC medications, including aspirin and ibuprofen or other prescription medications, without consulting your physician. Avoid prolonged exposure to sunlight and use sunscreen or wear protective clothing to avoid photosensitivity reaction. And finally, this medication may also cause drowsiness, so use caution while driving or performing other activities requiring mental alertness. That's all for this video, subscribe and click on the bell icon for more animated medical videos like this one, and also check our recommended products in the description.